Wild get it into the Hawks zone. Coyle going wide on Jalmerson, nearly got to the goal. Wild, or the Coyle dropped it back. Spurgeon goes across Suter along Rich Cut. Oh, and Crawford never saw it. Middle and Devanik on the right side. But the other guy, Schrader, had seven shots on goal. I, I'm shocked he's not playing in this game tonight. Here's a long shot by Roosevelt, tips just wide. Picked up by Shaw Centering. Oh, and somehow it stayed out of the net with Backstrom down and out on the other side. Uh, it's taken by Pommeville, whose pass is picked off. Good stick, Seabrook. Out comes Hosa. Hosa gets the line to Saad. Pull it to the forehand center. And Tay is right to the goal. Flipped in front, Hosa. Marion Hosa. Beautiful setup by Jonathan Tay. The whole line figured in the goal, and the Hawks have the lead. And Marion Hosa, who will turn 36 years of age tomorrow, gets an early birthday present. Our Honda Goal replay will show the initial play by Marion Hosa up to Brandon Saad, puts on the brakes, and then Jonathan Taze puts this puck back to the front of the net. Nicholas Backstrom loses his net, and Marion Hosa's got a wide open net. But a power move there from Taves. Hosa stays in front of the net. He hangs it. And he's the one that ended it. You see the Hawks. Record when they get the first goal. Hosa's got it again. He just wanted to save back to him. Able to hang on. No man. Minnesota waiting for them to complete a line change. Spurgeon. Pass off the mark, but it bounced to Fontaine. Then Nieder on a driving, shooting. Oh, Crawford gave him a little room on the short side. And they were able to make the left arm stop. Kane looking to Keith. He moves in, lets it go. He's hoping for a Bickle tip, and he just missed it. Now a chance for Kane up the middle. He's centered to Bickle. He scores! What a pass! Brian Bickle just had to finish it, but a spectacular setup by Patrick Kane. And the Hawks up two. This is textbook cycling offensive hockey. Seabrook to Richards to Kane. Bickle stick on the ice right into blue paint. No chance for Nicholas Backstrom. But quick puck movement, strength in numbers, support to the front of the net, and the Blackhawks with a 2 nothing lead. And our Honda Go replay shows us. Brian Bickle putting the puck in the back of the net. Rodin's clearing attempt held in momentarily by Sharp. Now Taves has got a two sharp, the shot. Back to me by the score. No goal. I thought it was in. Hit the post and stayed out. Boo to Suter. Now Pominville. Who can really bring it? He goes down low. Tough attempt. Parise has stopped. Koibu a shot. And good save by Crawford. And the rebound cleared. Around aboard Spurgeon. Goes to the deep slot, Brodeen. Spurgeon. Brodeen walks in, shoot it, good save with the left pad uh, by Crawford, rebound Coyle, couldn't get it through Keith. Held in Spurgeon, both teams are at full strength. As Oduya took a hit but cleared it ahead. Here's Saad driving, centering, Hosa, his stick tied up. Oh, and it went behind Backstrom, and the Wild dug it right out of the goal crease. They're playing their third game in four days. A real tough travel involved in that, but as you said, as Parise shot is stopped by Cropper, rebound back to him, and he's able to juggle and hold on Hollow's mid. And it's taken back by Seabrook, who got hit hard and unable to get it out. Coil out of the corner. Slipped it in front. Here's a shot by Prosser. Big save by Crawford. He went shoulders high from his knees. A good stop. <laughs> There'll be some unhappy folks. Here's Kane trying to move in. Couldn't find a lane. Kane for Taves. Right on back from the save. Rebound. Just out of the reach of Keith. And Brodziak cleared it. Prosser. Shaw rolled it back. And it's picked off by the Wilds. Paula. Cleared it in. Parise drives. Pulls up a spin around a backhand pass. Bounced all the way to Crawford. He'll take a whistle. A little help from a friend and Tara Vinen. His pass deflecting. Nieder Ryder then checked by Roosevelt. Knocked him right down. On the puck over the glass, out of play. Gets it into the zone. And Zucker got turned around, came up with a puck drive in the net, a tough shot down low. Crawford, he had it, lost it now. Loose to the wild. Foline couldn't find a lane. Zucker centered it. Here's Prosser, goal pump. Nate Prosser joined the play. Carries it into the zone, left to Terravine and for Sharp. And the goal turns in behind. 
Now he rolls it back to Rosaball. Keith, a one-timer, and a save by Backstrom. Corner. Rosaball able to keep it in. Rumblad shot and a save by Backstrom. Rebound taken by Niederreiter. Good shift, good way to get the momentum on your side right here with the shot line. Sharp shot, caught off by Backstrom. The Wild finally get it out. Solid shift like that. The Shaw line gave it to him. Now Bickle trying to follow up. Got it to Kane. Walks in, shooting. And a block into the score. A shot was blocked of it right to Brad Richards. And bang, the Blackhawks have a three goal lead. And Patrick Kane will pick up an assist there. This is his 13th multiple point game of the year. We're halfway through. Well, let's give an assist to the Shaw, Sharp, Tara Vinen line for setting the table in our Honda goal replay shows us. Brad Richards, all he's got to do, get to that area of the ice, stick on the ice, and go top shelf. The luncheon as well. Suter's long shot. Oh, that is a good block from Kruger. And then it's cleared to Smith. Keith is up with him. Ben Smith gets into the zone, lets it go. Fought off. Baxter came well out to challenge, made the save. Might hit him right in the mask. Christian Foley was never drafted. 23 years of age, he clears this end of his own. There's Parise with a centering pass. Huffman able to stick it away. And the puck taken by Suter. His pass picked off. Taves walks in, dropped it. Host a shot at Taves. Back to rebound. Made it out of the zone. In behind. And Commonville sends Zucker out of the wild end. Zucker trying to dance jumpers, and he did. He walks in. Penalty O'Dewey, that might be a penalty shot, it is. That will be a penalty shot for Jason Zucker as he undressed Nick Jalmerson. Three games been hot of late for the Wild. A chance to give Minnesota a little life. Zucker with some speed up the middle, missed the net. He went to the backhand, shot it wide. Big contact in the corner on Rosaval. Cook who delivered the blow and rolled loose, got it back, quick shot. Good block from Glad on Cook. It's held in by Prosser, his long one tip. What a save by Crawford, rebound is loose, and Crawford covering in the blue paint. Best save of the game for Corey Crawford. Suter stripped by Hosa. He moved it out, here's a two on one. Taves has side with him, and Oduya two, three on one. Here's Oduya, the trailer, he shot, they score! Spurgeon did everything right, he broke up a pass, then he made a shot block and hit him and went in. When it's going bad, that's the way things work for the Wild. They're down four. Another incredible play by Marion Hosa. All you young hockey players out there, watch the stick of Marion Hosa. His stick is on the ice. He takes the puck away from Ryan Suter and then makes the incredible pass up to Jonathan Taves. You said it, Pat. Spurgeon plays this absolutely perfectly. But Johnny O, is Johnny on a spot? Hoibu, good stick by Taves right at the blue line. Commonville gains the zone with a wrist shot. Handled easily by Crawford to Keith. Back to Shaw, his wrist shot. Kicked away by Backstrom. Rumblad kept it in. Shaw. Rumblad. Here it comes. Save rebound. Oh, Tara Vinen had a great rebound chance, and Backstrom stopped it. So they've strung their record together. This year have been not a lot of nights like this. Yeah. There have been a couple uh, runaway type games, but quite often uh, it's white knuckle right to the end. Here's a shot by Keith and a save. Backstrom. He's played well against us, Pat. Uh, when he was a member of the Columbus Blue Jackets, now with the Philadelphia Flyers and having an unbelievable season. Now the team, not so much, but you know, we know Tyler Sagan down in, uh, in Dallas. I mentioned this earlier, this young guy was never drafted, but uh, worked his way into the rotation of the Minnesota defense. Christian Froline, long shot here, shooter, good save, Crawford. He did a good job in traffic, now it's loose to Smith. Ryan Bickle, that dump it, I think you might have seen it. It hit him in the backside, maybe the back of the leg, and uh, he is limping to the Hawks bench. That's not what he was hoping to have happen, or anybody would late in the game. Here's a shot, they scored a rebound. The shutout bid of 
Laurie Crawford ends on a rebound goal from Matt Cook in the wild, down three. This line has had a couple of decent looks for the Minnesota Wild. Brodziak, Carter, and Cook. Direct the puck towards the net, the shot from Brodziak, right pad, and Matt Cook just going right to the net. And Made some really good plays. That line has had a, a really good night. Yeah. They, they've really generated a, a lot of good scoring chances. And nothing to show for it, but lots of positives there for the youngster. Here's a one-timer. Good save by Crawford. A fine pass. Vanek to Pominville through. Let's follow up on that because Corey Crawford, I think, really back-to-back -back performances yeah. now. Starting to look more like the guy we saw before he got hurt. Yeah, no, no question about it. And we've talked a lot about it all year, Pat. The goaltending has been A-plus all season long. 